or with the headphones. Okay, let's go back this way. Oh, what the hell's that? Oh, it's got tracking! Oh, it's got tracking, that's rude. Oh, and it's got a shield? No, wait, I can do no damage to it. What? What? What is this? I'm perplexed. Oh, I I have to hit the ball? I'm playing tennis. I have to play tennis with it. Oh, that's funny as fuck. I, I have to play tennis. That's great. No, the regular attack was doing it. Oh, boys. You, you picked the wrong time there. Funnily enough, grenades don't care about grazing hits. So, uh, that works. Uh, wow, in fact, you could do that a second time. Can he really do that a second time? How many of those has he got left? Three. Fuck it. Totally worth it. <laughs> now that, ladies and gentlemen, is a war crime. <laughs> I don't know, that's just, that's just hit me funny. I don't know why. Why throw one gas grenade when you can throw two? Oh. Uh, okay, this is a... Oh, he's... Okay, he's got a shield, but that's fine. I've I've got I've got tentacles. Hello, sir. Can I introduce you to our Lord and Savior? Oops. He's not dead. Fair play. He's very not dead, actually. Oh God. Oh, I have to fight him in this room. Okay, luckily he's not. Oh, hang on. I had to pack my out the door. Okay, let's try that again, shall we? Now he's dead. Oh! Oh my god! I hit him so hard, his... his... Oh dear. Be careful with your tentacles, ladies and gentlemen, otherwise this could happen to you too. I marked it just up the road. Alright. Oh, that's a, that's an entire... Combo, not combo, oh, yeah, that's place. a that's a that's a bossy. Yep. Shall I start minigunning? Uh, you want to start minigunning? I can. Oh, I can't. oh that was me! Sorry, I deployed my drone and it killed the helicopter. I forget he threw it up. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, sorry about that. That's entirely on me. <laughs> Any landing that you walk away from, I guess. In Honestly. The bloody names of some of these systems are amazing. And the fact there's no hope for me to actually pronounce them. What was that noise? Oh, 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 oh. I mean, is that like hello in rock person? What the fuck was that? <laughs> that sounded like the start of a Disney movie or something. What the hell? Uh, form non aggression pact. Okay, so the Bin Penchan really like us. I mean, what? Come on. Holy shit, time to go. Where, where am I extracting to honor? Because I need, I need. Oh, oh god! Everything's exploding. Tremors detected. Well, yeah, no shit. We just introduced a black hole into the middle of the planet. How do we get out of here? Okay, we're going that way. Oh my god! There's fucking shriekers. Are you fucking kidding me? What? This is level one. We're not supposed to have shriekers. What the actual Christmas fuck? That's not right! Uh. <laughs> oh my god. Who 
a silly idea was this? Fuck me. Uh, yeah, right. Okay. Uh, hmm. He should not survive that. This enemy soldier is pinned down. Hello. Oh, I shot that guy instead. Oh, he broke my overwatch. That's rude. A hundred and four? I'm gonna make it. Tell my agent, release the nudes. A hundred and four? There we go. Helps if it unmute the mic. There we go. That's much better. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. It is I, Hamster of Wrath, uh, with some more Ghost of Tsushima. This is a bit of an impromptu stream. Um, OBS released the latest iteration of OBS, uh, which includes the new Twitch uh, encoding, which means I can use a much higher bandwidth uh, my end, so hopefully the stream should look a little bit nicer, because all the transcoding is being done at my end, so it's going to be very interesting. We're going to see how that pans out. Um, I haven't had any problems testing the bandwidth, but yeah, we're going we're gonna to try it in situ and see how we go. Uh, we already have PM Collector Boy in chat. Welcome, welcome. Uh, Stellaris DLC Burnout. There is, I forget, if I think at full price, if you buy all the DLC for Stellaris in one go, is it something like 300 quid? Or, or whatever the equivalent is in dollars? It is, it is quite a lot, and there are many, many DLCs, yeah. <laughs> okay, let's give this a go. Uh, hey, Quentlist. Yeah, not so far. I was testing the, uh, like, encoding. So the the uh, the bandwidth test, and it seemed to be okay, because uh, I used to be, like, the soft cap on Twitch was, like, 6,000. And um, now I can set it to pretty much whatever I like. So, uh, yeah, this would be fine. Uh, DCS World store page? Uh, what's that? So, hopefully the stream does look nice, because we're actually broadcasting at 60 FPS, and in the past, we've been doing 30 FPS, and obviously since this game is full of foliage, um, I figured that would be a pretty good yardstick to see if it, uh, explodes. But, uh, we'll see how it goes. Where's my horse? Is my horse malfunctioned? Horse? Well, first slight problem, my horse appears to have uh, malfunctioned. Third time's a charm, there he is. He was clearly, uh, had busy things to do. Uh, DCS itself is free, but don't look at the LC. Oh, okay, so they kind of, they get you in with, ah, oh, this is free, but all the DLC costs a fortune. Ah, uh, okay. So hopefully this isn't a fuzzy, discombobulated mess on stream, because it should be adjusting my bandwidth to handle the, um, handle the grass and stuff, so I hope it looks okay. Because previously I've been streaming in 30 FPS, uh, which has neatened it up a little bit. We're going full beans and 60 FPS at the moment, so it will be intriguing to see what it looks like. Hey, Bamboozle, how's it going? Uh, DCS is a sim. Oh, okay, I didn't know what DCS was. Also, oh, it's a flight sim thing. Ah, uh, okay. They sell airplanes at Alcarta's DLC. I see. So, do you have any planes at all when you start, or do you have to buy all of them? <laughs> oh, God, my one biggest complaint about the new, um, uh, the new version of OBS is the bloody volume controls. They are the ugliest fucking thing I've ever seen. But that is a fairly minor complaint, I will be brutally honest. But, uh, god, they're ugly. Train sim? You see, I, I can't, I can't, I can't judge people for playing train sim, because, you know, some of my hobbies probably strike other people as weird and boring. So, you know, I can't judge. Samurai butt! Right, what are we, uh, what are we reflecting on today? 
training Mustang and one Russian jet I forget the name of. Oh, okay. Reflect on Lady Masako or clearing my mind. Uh, let's do some clearing of mind. Stop thinking, Jen. For one moment, just stop thinking. <laughs> stop thinking, Jin. Embrace idiots. Oh yeah, if you sh if you shop around, um, I must admit I do not buy most of my stuff um, full price anymore. I I do not buy them from dodgy places, but I buy them uh, from from certain places. Um, all crisis run right before I get unbidden to war in heaven. One day we might go back to that game, but I feel it was baking my noodle a little bit. It's a, it's a great game, but I really have to be on the ball. And if I haven't got like a deep a decent like night sleep and I've got a Stellaris session, it's a bit of a dumpster fire. But then lots of people tune in for a dumpster fire, so you know. Hey the Archaeos, day two of cooking pizza, mocked improvement. Excellent! I think I made my own pizza once. Uh, I'm sure I told people this. I made a cheese and marmite pizza when I was very young. Very young. It wasn't bad, actually. Oh, that guy's got bombs. Uh, uh, excuse you. Ow, ow, ow. Forgot that's unblockable. Oh, perfect parry. Have some of that, sir. Two perfect parries. Have some of that, sir. Who are I? Oh, you're on the floor. Oh, you're dead. Well, well that works. Not well, bam. That was pretty effective. I play Star Citizen, so I can't judge anything. I know people do enjoy Star Citizen, but when I looked at it, when when I saw, I think it was Wabba, was was trying to get out of the tutorial on the free day. Um, it looked like a struggle to me, but I'm sure once you can get the hang of it, it's probably good fun. Uh, but yeah, I made a cheese and marmite pizza. It was a uh, it was a marmite base dough, marmite base with cheese on top. I was very obsessed with marmite when I was younger. Don't really know why. Not quite as obsessed as uh, with it as I am now, to be honest. So, no, other way around, or something. I don't know. <laughs> so, brutal honesty. How does the stream look? This is this is the core of the experiment today. Does the stream look hunky dory? I'm expecting it to still like break up a little bit, but hopefully it's not egregiously. No point starting Star Citizen until 4.0 drops. <laughs> okay. Why I liked watching your Panic Hedgehog streams. Excellent. Yeah. Yeah, I thought we, we kind of did... Uh, we, we did kind of go with identity with the Panic Hedgehogs, but unfortunately the Panic Hedgehog situation turned into a bit of a hug box, didn't it? So... Which is a bit of a shame. Everyone was too nice. Looks fine. Excellent. Well... Previously to now, we've been uh, running it at 30 FPS, so the fact we're actually running it at um, 60 and it's looking good, I am think okay. It looked better at 936, but it's not terrible. Yeah, I'm not expecting it to be like 100% sort of like crystal, because there is so much foliage in this. Um, but yeah, I'm kind of hoping it's not like terrible, terrible. Oh, kill enemies with a longbow. Okay, that's going to be a bit tricky. I've only got three arrows left. Four arrows left. Which is actually one more arrow than I actually need, providing I don't miss. Which is quite possible I could. Yeah, the wind and dust that always makes it a pain in the butt side. Oh, hit. he turned around, unsurprisingly. Oh, he blocked that. Well, never mind. Oh, dear. Not going well, not going well. Oh, come on, that was a... I'm trying to hit the guy. What? Why are you not letting me hit this guy? Oh, ammo, need that. Grab ammo. No, 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 I'm running and I want to do that 
That's what I wanted to do. God damn it. We good now? That was scrappy. That was a little scrappy. Yeah, it's soon. it's topping out at kind of like about uh, 10,000 um, KPPS, Thank which you, Lord, usually I'm restricted to like eight. So it's probably not like, obviously we've doubled the frame rate as well. So, I mean, I could, I, can I adjust the frame rate on the fly? I don't think I can. I wonder if trying to get a 30, 30 FPS again might be an idea, but I don't know. Like I said, bit of an experiment. Right. Okay, that was disaster. And I have a funny feeling we'd probably missed our bonus objective. Because I didn't kill anyone with a longbow. So, uh, never mind, eh? But that's okay. So, funnily enough, I've actually nerfed myself a little bit. Um, 30 FPS. Let me have a... I don't think I can change frame rate dynamically. Let me have a quick look. I'm pretty sure I can't. No, nah, I'd have to restart the stream. Um, but yeah, it'll be it'll be interesting to see. Right, do I actually have arrows now? I do. This is good. Right, he's standing in front of a door. I should be able to get him. Excellent. That's one. Oh, no, he didn't die. Shit. Now he did. Have to aim for the head. Okay, maybe getting a little closer might be an idea. Oh, he's found a body. Yeah, that figures. And... Okay. That's two. Just need one more now. And then we can be as crazy as we like. Oh no, he saw a body. Oh no. Oh no, no, he's coming this way. Was that three? That was three. Nice. Okay, shit, where's the, where's the hostage? Uh, crap, 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 crap. Must rescue hostage. I actually had the option of assassinating him there and I failed miserably. That's more like it. Oh, yeah, right. To actually finish my anecdote, I have actually nerfed myself slightly, though it doesn't probably look like it. I'm actually wearing the uh, Hero of Tsushima armor, which actually reduces damage less than the other clan armor, because I was finding it a little bit easy. <laughs> like, stuff. So, I've I've nerfed myself a little bit, so I'm hoping maybe it'll make it a little bit more challenging. Because the amounts of shots I could tank with the other armor was ridiculous. Thank you, my lord. You're safe now. That that shadow has malfunctioned. I don't know what's going on with that shadow. It wasn't very happy. It was an unhappy shadow. Uh, right. That's good. Wait, why is the bird showing up as an enemy? Oh, that's because it's the eagle. Yeah, I see you, little bastard. Come here. I missed. Well, look, I've killed everyone. You should get, cut me some slack. Oh, God. It's point blank and I can't hit it. I literally can't hit it. It's right there. There we go. Fuck you, bird. Right, I hope he didn't tell his friends, because that would be very embarrassing. That was a uh, fine example of how not to hit your target at point blank range. Hey, come react. Where's the giggling dog popping out of the grass when you miss? That's Duck Hunt. I remember Duck Hunt. I had that on uh, the NES. And I think I had the light gun to go with it. Yay! Old games. I remembered those. Oh, shit. God damn it, there's another cheeky bird. Fuck it. Ow. Oh, no, not you. Oh, there we go. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, chill, 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 chill. 
Oh dear. No, 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 sir. Unhand the hostage, thank you. Much obliged. I, I was about to say I have probably, both me and Conreact have probably dated ourselves very badly due to how old Duck Hunt actually is, it's true. There you go, that's quite enough out of you, bird. You'll be free soon. Wait, did I not kill the bird sufficiently? You saved us. Did they find your key to Gosaku's armor? <laughs> they could have the key for all I care. Gosaku is a hero from a children's story. You don't believe the armor exists? Not at all. Take our key and see for yourself, my lord. Who is Gosaku and... One of six keys that said to lead to Gosaku's armor. I didn't even know that was a thing I was looking for. Chicken dinner tonight, yeah. I feel like chicken tonight. Okay, interesting. Didn't even know that was a thing. Where is he? Where Where are you, little fucker? Oh, oops. Now what? Oh, liberate the village. Great stuff. Twenty more levels on you, yeah. Yeah, I get that happens a lot in the uh, Dark Souls games. Hey, look, there's a dude. I'm sure I can fight him. Oh crap. Crucible lights do not fuck about. Yeah, there you go. Well, honestly, look, you've lost, bird. Where are you? Where Where is it? Am I just stuck with that now? Look, come back here, and I'll shoot you down, and then... I think I might be stuck with this symbol. That's annoying. I am now stuck with a bird symbol. That's brilliant. Son of a bitch. I hope that will go away at some point, because... Uh, I think it was trying to get their attention while I was uh, in the village, uh, in the conversation, and I think it broke it. That's not good. <laughs> I might have to restart that. Because if that's going to be there forever, that's going to be mighty, mighty annoying. Uh, Legend Storyteller, that's fine. Is there anything else here, I think? Oh, wait, I haven't actually... Oh, no, I have liberated it. I was like, wait, I haven't actually liberated it. Lost at Sea. Okay, that quest has been around for a while, and since we're here... We may as well go and investigate. I'm going to fast travel quick, see if that fixes that. Um, if not, I'm going to go for a restart, because I don't want that symbol hanging around the entire time. There we go, that's fixed it. Uh, that away. Okay. As always, for some reason, all my timers have decided to turn up all at once, which is not really the purpose of having a timer, but never mind. So sorry for the for the uh, bot spam there, everybody. That shouldn't be doing that in quite a short of interval, so uh, never mind. I'm going to have to look at that at some point. Right. Looney swinging sword on the beach, who is not me. I was literally about to say, oh look, solar panels, and then I realised what uh, time zone, time era we're in. That is in fact them drying seaweed, there's most assuredly not solar panels. Uh, okay, slight problem. How do we, do I have to swim? I have to swim. Oh boy. Uh, so many people bloodstains from there, fucking up the jump down section. <laughs> no, gravity takes no prisoners. No. Gravity does not have any favourites. Yeah, I gather falling in those games usually doesn't work out pretty well. Nori solar panels, yeah. Mmm, Nori panels. Not really what you want, is it? Well, maybe it is. I don't know, and no judge.
Yeah, I I can just swim. It's it's waterproof, really. It's it's uh. It's it's actually cosplay. It's not actually re real armor at all. Wait, hang on. This has got all doofy again with the frame rate. Give me a second. Let's see if I can fix that. There you go. That's better. Yeah, it would get very heavy. Yeah. Put that down before you hurt yourself. I am sorry if my lack of skill offends, my lord. But I have to do something. The Mongols captured my daughter. Where did the dogs take her? Oh, those are ships. The ones with the Lord's sails. Two vessels. Who knows how many Mongols? You won't stand a chance. I found a boat, a sword. Uh, maybe a friendly samurai can help? Get in the boat and grab an oar. Wait, are we doing are we doing ship combat? Me. Oh come on, are we gonna Assassin's Creed it? Or are we just gonna out, my lord. I I like this idea. I don't think stealth is gonna be very helpful. We're gonna be on a ship. It's fairly close quarters. Please bring Maki back safely. With you, you'll return soon. I kind of wish we could do the whole Assassin's Creed thing, where you could just swim out to a boat and beat everyone up. Um, but this is fine. Oh, he said, nearly giving away his position immediately. I wonder if I can kung fu this guy off the boat. No, that's not. That's not take the chance. You can just imagine the other guys going. They seem to be falling asleep very badly. You want to go back and black flag again? Black flag was so good. I love black flag. It's so funny that Ubisoft did such a fuck up with Skull and Bones. It's literally, if they took the assassins out of Assassin's Creed Black Flag, everyone would have been happy. And they probably would have made a mint. Uh, but unfortunately, they just, they didn't do that. <laughs> For reasons I'm not fully sure of. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Okay, he's there. Oh, he's moving around. Ember. Ember yourself. Wait, what's this? Oh, I can drop down the side. Okay. Okay, can we... If I just shot this guy from up... No, he's... Well, he's kind of facing away from me. Okay, let's... Let's try it. The fact I can assassinate from the front is quite useful. Yeah! <laughs> What's that? No one's playing it? Yeah, exactly. Like I said, I bet you everyone took one look at that and said, let's just let's just boot up Black Flag again, because that's that's how you do that. Okay, is that everyone on this boat? I think it is. That looks like a prisoner, but I don't know if it's the prisoner. Yeah, I remember people saying good things about Beyond Good and Evil. Um, I think I was like quite an early generation game, that one. Okay, did we actually manage 100% stealth? I think we did. Holy crap. Ubisoft was essentially made to pay for it by the Singapore government? Okay, then. Oh, no, wait, that's our guy. That's our guy. I thought that's not a prisoner. That's the guy that's, uh, waiting for us to do cool shit. Okay, uh, do I just... No, that seems like a bad idea. It was heavily subsidized? Ah, uh, okay. Right, I think it'd be safer if I kind of swam across there, so let's try that. Then I can... Oh, oh, apparently I don't know how ladders work. Ladder, gin, ladder, gin. There you go. 
Okay, group of people there, one guy there. Don't know where... Now you see, if this was Assassin's Creed Black Flag, what I would do is probably go to the end of the ship, climb up the figurehead and attack it lengthwise, but because this isn't Assassin's Creed, I can't really do that. They're gonna see me. Hmm. Hmm, let's be fast, let's be fast. I saw nothing. I saw nothing. I saw nothing. Don't turn around. Don't turn around. Don't turn around. He's not exactly quiet, is it? Mobile style game mini games. That sounds like a great idea. Yeah. Yeah. It's like, uh, it's like Diablo Immortal all over again, isn't it? It's like, do you guys not have phones? It's like, uh... I don't think I'll ever let that one down. That was really quite funny. Like, do you guys not have phones? It's like, yeah, we do have phones, but Diablo is a PC game, so wh why are you what about? You madman. Oh no, oh no, oh shit. No, you saw nothing. Oh shit. Oh, that's fun while that lasted. No, 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 no. Ugh. Ow. No. No. Could I? Oh, shit. Did I get everyone? That was scrappy. It was scrappy. That must be mucky. But it worked. You're going to be all right. Mucky? Yes. Your father's waiting with his boat. Come with me. I'll stay close, my lord. Thank you. You killed them all. They deserve this. I know. I just. I can't believe it's over. Yeah, I will say that the intelligent little bit of design they have in missions like this is that if you do what I did, which was make an absolute hash about it and swing your sword around like a frothing maniac, you can't, like, hit the hostage. Which is good, because if you could hit the hostage, I would have killed many hostages by now. So, uh, yeah, kind of glad that's a thing. Wait, did I get the steel that was under the stairs? Sorry, madam, I need to loot. There was some there was some steel under the stairs, I think, on the other boat. Um which obviously she can't follow me to, so never mind, I guess we'll give up on that. <laughs> Can she climb ladders? That's the important question, because if she can't, I don't know if she's getting out of here. My lord, why are we not leaving? I I, I am looting. What what is looting? <laughs> It's a thing you do in computer games, when you have to gather resources. And you've killed a shit ton of people. See, so yeah, I must admit, wearing the armor that is not completely OP doesn't appear to have slowed me down that much. Though I have taken a bit more damage recently, which I think is a bit fair, because that, that Samurai clan armor, it was just like, I was just a tank. Which didn't improve my sword skills any, because I was getting hit too often, it wasn't actually making a difference, so... I'm sure I saw some iron under the stairs. Hang on. Sorry, madam. Well, now I've forgotten where the stairs were, so that's never mind about that. All right, those of you who come back from the ad, you haven't missed anything. I was just running around looting, so uh, uh, nothing really missed. Uh, madam, can you can you operate the ladder? Is that is that? Can Mark you do that? I'm hey! Oh, oh, thanks to God. Get us back to shore. Right away, my lord. You're safe now. I was with them for days, father. Days. I should have come sooner. You both need rest. Get to shelter as soon as you have the strength to run. We will, my lord. Thank you. 
Wait, did he say they both need rest? He was sat in the... He sat in the bloody... He was sat in the boat during all of that. I did the hard work. Jesus. I suppose he rode me out there, which I imagine was probably quite taxing. So, there you go. Team effort. Uh, Charm of Resistance 1. I think we've already got one of those, haven't we? Yes. Okay. I don't need that, but that's okay. Let me well, I'd leave this shore because it's full of fucking Mongol ships. That's what I'd do. I would be fucking off inland at quite a rate of fucking knots if that was me. But, you know, you do you. Um, yeah, that's true. Yeah, we've got the... Uh, um, the Father's Armour to get. That's way to the north, I think. That's all the way up here. I'm doing the usual thing in these games where I'm side-questing the hell out of everything. Uh, I believe it's visiting the old village, which is there. Um, whereas I'm still finding things to do down here at the moment, so... There's like this this entire place we have not actually visited, so... And there's the more question marks up there. So we could just head very northward. Oh no, wait, there's another, um... There's another, uh, thing to liberate. And another thing to liberate! No, we have plenty to do. Including a lot of swimming. I must admit, I am quite happy with this little extra bit of software they've incorporated into OBS now. Because, basically, I'm not going to have to fiddle around with frame rates and stuff as much. I uh, Okay, I'm sure this probably breaks up a little bit because there's a lot of foliage in it. But, like, especially with turn-based stuff, it should be fine. Um, So, I think it's quite cool because, yeah, it just, like... Here's more bandwidth. I'm like, I'm always good for more bandwidth. Imagine being the weather man. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's true. Every time it gets stormy, I just I just blow my whistle and it's like it, it'd be like providing Jin Sakai does not traverse, does not blow his whistle, it will be rainy, unpleasant, and overclouded. Overcrowded. Clouded? Overclouded. That's not a word. Um Overcast, that's the word I'm looking for. Uh, if he does blow his whistle, it'd be a lovely, lovely, shiny day. Probably full of death. Um, so yeah, that'd be quite funny. But I think someone was saying the other day, uh, if you use, like, backstabbing and stuff... Wait, what is this? Um, it makes the weather go dark and stormy. And if you, like, fight honourably, the weather is is pleasant, apparently. That's a dead person in a box. I don't think I can do much about that. Um, the man in the box. Uh, it might have been a woman, for all I could tell, to be honest, but... Hitchhiker's guy. He doesn't know it's he's a rain god and it rains wherever he goes. Yeah, yeah, along those lines. Well, eventually, this is this is the thing. Um, where is it? Is it accessories? Yeah, here we go. Eventually, apparently, we can... Um, when we found another cricket, uh, we can choose one of these new ones so we can make it stormy, make it foggy, or make it rain. Uh, the only one we know at the moment is, is the sun one. So, yeah. You often find the crickets are in the graveyards, I think. That's the only place I've found them so far. Does the fog work on stealth? It might, I guess. Yeah, that's a fair shout, actually. Also, I wonder if the cricket... Well, I doubt the crickets respawn. But I'm pretty sure the only place I found them is in, uh, in a graveyard. Wait, I'm full on bamboo? Damn, I need to spend some of my resources. Apparently I've got uh, too many of them. Where am I going here? Not that way. Oh, actually, there's a camp there. If we head towards the camp, I might better spend some of them. I 
see. What upgrades am I eligible for, actually? That's a bloody good question. Uh, five new vanity gear and eight upgrades. Oh, okay. Oh, I can upgrade my sword. Holy shit. I have been gathering resources like a mad bastard. Excellent. Let's check in on the camp and see what we can make. Gravity defying horse there. That's impressive. Hello, I have arrived. Hey, castle, how's it going? Welcome, welcome. Oh, I keep forgetting. I don't need to do that. I just need to pause it. Hang on. There we go. I'll get there in a minute. Let me get a shout out there. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well. Right. What can I uh, spend this nonsense on? How can I help you? Uh, ooh, range capacity. Flaming arrows. Heavy arrow, explosive arrow. Oh, hello. Uh, oh, wow. Okay, we got 109 hides. Okay, sure. An excellent choice. Yeah, damn straight. Uh, gonna play, go play poker in a bit. <laughs> I figured that makes sense, judging by what you were streaming last time. Uh, I'm not being found Sergeant Pepper as your father is. I mean, I'm one of those weird people. I just for you. I fully accept the impact that the Beatles had on the music scene. I'm just. I just think they're slightly, like, everyone treats them like they're the second coming, and I kind of think that, that they were, like, influential, but they, they're not really my jam. Which probably makes me a heretic in some people's eyes, but, uh... But undeniably had a, a massive effect on the music scene. I, I do not deny that at all. Just for you. Okay, that's good. So that's what all my hides were for, so that's good. Come back if you need anything, my lord. Some of it was absolute drivel. Yeah, there's a, there's a couple of tunes. There's a couple of tunes I quite like. I actually cannot stand the Beatles. There you go. R C Castle in there with the uh, brutal honesty. F forget forget me and my my sort of like soft softly softly approach. I can't stand the Beatles. That's that's fair. I I salute you for the the strength of your opinion. Red Dead Redemption 2 told me how much I suck at poker. I... I have a weird thing with poker. I I have a very, very odd relationship with poker. I don't gamble that much. Well, I don't gamble at all. Um... I have this weird, like, idiot savant thing going on with poker. In that even though I don't know what I'm doing half the time... I win at it more often than I lose, and I have a sneaking suspicion it comes down to because I don't know what I'm doing. My opponent doesn't know what I'm doing either. Ergo, if I don't know what they're doing and they don't know what they're doing, but they don't know what I'm doing, I, I can't be predicted. I, I feel that's the idea. You need to try Bellatro? What's, what's Bellatro? Uh, Vegas Infinite is actually free, lots of fun, no real money involved. Ah, okay. Bellatro is Bellatro. Okay. <laughs> that clears it up. That that's uh that's clear as brick. So gamble away. <laughs> now even in like games, even like 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 PM Collector Boy was saying about Red Dead Redemption 2, um, in that, I it's like it's guesswork. I'm like, I've got no idea what most of my cards mean. I know the royal ones are important. <laughs> But it's just kind of like, it just feels like, you know... I'm literally making up as I go. Right, that's going to be tricky, because those guys are surrounding the hostage. That's going to be a little messy. Except that guy. That guy's dead in the reeds, so... Uh, similar to Inscription, but with poker themes? Oh, okay. I've seen a couple of people play Inscription, and I'm just, just utterly was left cold by it. I, I'm going to be honest with you. I appreciate some people enjoy it, but I was just like, why, why I, I don't know why I would play this game. Right. 
we can do some ninja action here. Let's try it. Whee! You saw nothing. And now you won't see anything ever again. <laughs> ninja vanish. Let's hope nobody comes around here and finds the corpse. That could be a slight problem. Uh, how much this game? Um, depending on where you get it from. Um, I think it's like 50 quid. Uh, full whack, I think. Um, I picked it up for 38. I shopped around a bit and picked it up for 38. Which I thought was pretty good. Oh, whoop, 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 he saw me. Oh, wait, hang on. I, should, I shouldn't have given up the high ground. Anakin! The high ground. Right, that's a terrible Obi-Wan impression. That was awful. Anakin. No, let's just let, abort that impression. Abort the impression. Oh, shit. Oh, they've seen me. Oh, fuck. This is fine. No, 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 no. Ugh. Are we good? I mean, that's two thirds stealth. Two thirds stealth. Still counts. Hold still. Uh, slay the spire. My prayers have been answered. Find somewhere safe. Be careful. I must admit, I kind of like. Um, I don't mind card-based stuff. To be honest, because like uh, I used to stream um, Guild of Dungeoneering, and that's actually quite a fun little game, and that's card based, so I didn't mind that. It, I think it has to be. Yeah, I don't know. I kind of flip flop on 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 card based games. To be honest, I also think the big thing about uh, Guild of Dungeoneering is it has such character. It kind of just keeps you going. Are they all surrounding the hit the hostage again? Oh, damage enemies with explosive arrow. Now, here's a question. Swords don't seem to matter. What if I accidentally hit the hostage with an explosive arrow? Would that would that be bad? That's an important question. Also, it doesn't say kill, it says damage. That's a very important distinction. Uh, 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 hmm. We do not grenade the hostages. You're right. Oh, and hey, Beat Steak, sorry, I didn't see you there. The, the white text filmed in a thing. Thank you for the poster check. But well, welcome. I hope you're doing well. Uh, ugh. I mean, if we if we get it wrong, you know, we can restart. Oh, that's not where the explosive arrows are. That's where the explosive arrows are. Right, okay, let's try it. Why is this bush on fire? Don't know. I think I killed the hostage. I didn't kill the hostage. Hostages are fireproof. This is a great development. They're not, however, swordproof. Like that guy. Wrong stance. Ow, ow. Shit. Good night! I may have messed this up slightly. Oh, that's entirely the wrong stance. No, no, don't kill the hostage! No! Dear, oh dear. Where's Samurai over? Ow, ow! Wait, what's roll? Roll's, roll's double, isn't it? Oh, he's got the hostage. Oh, no, he doesn't. Could I? Boom to the face. 
That was scrappy. <laughs> that was a lot of dudes. Fighting that many dudes all at once is ill-advised. <laughs> also, you're panicking about the hostage as well, so that's not really, uh... You're going to be all right. Oh, that guy's not dead. Hang on. <laughs> the guy crawling off on the left side of the frame. Oh, must get out of shot. I am taking up room. It's fine. Got it handled. Was that a, was that a dog? That was a dog. Uh, thank you very much for the follow, the Shogun Ryuji. Right, Ryuji? However you pronounce that. Welcome. Thank you very much for the follow. Okay, they had the dangerous attack dogs, so that was worth lobbing the grenade, because um, those dogs are fucking lethal. So I'm good with that. Right, okay. Was that everyone? No, one more. It's a great thing, I've made my I've made my stream alerts so subtle to, to, to work in with this game. I actually like sometimes can't tell whether it's in game or actually the, my stream alerts it's quite funny always wanted to play this game could never find the time to get it it's worth it i would say it's worth it um shop around a bit or wait for a sale maybe but um uh this is the pc port so um yeah i'm really enjoying it it's a little bit i was struggling to begin with the learning curve at the beginning was a bit tough uh, but once you've mastered a few techniques and upgraded your armor and stuff, it's, uh, it's really good fun. It's everything a new Ubisoft game wishes it was. <laughs> yeah! Yeah. A lot of people are saying, like, uh, yeah, that new Assassin's Creed game coming out, uh, why don't you just play Ghost of Tsushima instead? <laughs> like, eh. Off to play some poker. No problem, Castle Gaming. Thank you very much for dropping by, and enjoy. Yeah, it'll be it'll be very interesting to see what Assassin's Creed Shadows is going to be like. Like I say, I'm probably not going to pay that much attention to it because I feel I've got all of that gameplay wise is already in this. So, yeah. Uh, right. If I was the last hostage, where would I be, sir? I've just rescued you. You're literally standing. Never mind. You rescue somebody, and they just stand around in the open, waiting to be kidnapped a second time. Right, if I was the last hostage, where would I be? I mean, this village isn't huge. I should be able to figure this out. I even have Batman vision. But apparently it's not helping. Also, I'm moving too fast. It won't let me do it. Hello? Can I just send up a flare? Oh no, I suppose that. That means the bad guys know I'm here, which defeats the whole point. They've been making the same game over and over, yeah. Yeah, they've made the same game over and over, and then occasionally they get it wrong, which makes me laugh. It's like, if you're doing the same thing, you'd think they get it right at some point. I'm ne I, well, I'm never getting a Ubisoft sponsorship, am I? <laughs> Not that I really care, to be honest, but... Oh, this guy was completely... Oh, wow, we got lucky. We must have, uh... We must have attracted his squad uh, at the same time we were fighting the other guys, so that works out. Let me free you, sir. Hold still. Don't I actually say that? I thought the Mongols would take our heads, my lord. The Mongols seek the armor of a hero named Gosaku. Oh, what's that guy again? Please take this key to it. Oh, thanks. You deserve to wear it. I won't let the Mongols come near Gosaku's legacy. I will say, for all my all my dissing, I did enjoy Black Flag. Assassin's Creed Black Flag was good. Assassin's Creed Odyssey was good. Uh, Wildlands was good. So, you know, e even a broken clock is uh, right twice a day. <laughs> Yeah, that new Star Wars game. That will be, again, interesting to see how that pans out. Because it's like, you wouldn't think like an open world Star Wars game would be that difficult to pull off. But I'm sure somebody can manage to screw it up, so. Right, we have some technique points to spend. Uh, what do we do here? 
ghost. What have we got here? Uh, save yourself from defeat when wounded. Never use that ever. Improves standoff streak. Oh, I can kill three people in a standoff. That could be fun. Mental fortitude. Reduce concentration cooldown by 15. Okay. Chain assassination. Oh, wait. I didn't even know I had... Wait. Chain assassination is Q? Well, that's a little counterintuitive. Okay. I'm going to go with improved standoff streak. Screw it. Okay, so most of the time when I'm assassinating someone, it's left mouse. But now apparently if I have two people standing together, it's got to be Q. How often do you have two people standing together with their backs to me? Not very often. Right, do you guys have any side quests? That'd be great. Yeah, I guess you have to be, like, a little bit careful when you're exploring, um, cultural stuff, I guess. Even though it is entirely fictional, I can, I can understand people might get knocked off at it, but, yeah. I could have sworn. Did I see something flashing? Was it, ah, there we go. Oh, smoke bombs. Oh, never mind. Who would keep this many smoke bombs under their house? That seems like a very, very bad idea. One, they're in a puddle, which means they'll get soggy, and if they weren't soggy and they somehow caught fire, you'd have a smoke-filled house. I mean, madness, really. I'm, I'm taking that. I'm thinking too hard again. Having liberated your village, I am now stealing all your shit. Pass through the opening? Oh! Oh, it's a window. I knew that. You could have just called it a window. <laughs> the opening. That's a window. Oh, sorry, so entirely by accident, we f we were on the path of this uh, magical armor thing, or whatever is going on with that. G Gosaku's armor? Yeah. A rushing river crossing. I mean, let's go liberate that. Which is that away. <laughs> Well, that looks like the aftermath of a bandit attack that I wasn't... Uh, well, maybe this is this is a bandit attack I revenged earlier, but uh, I can't remember. Come on, give me a Mongol posse to deal with. I want to try my new skill. Am I still heading in the right direction? Yes, that's good. So actually, even with the armor that has the lessened... Oh, here we go. No, 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 no. I want to do standoff. Yes, standoff, standoff, standoff. Go, 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 go. Here we go. Right, so there's there's four of them. I should be able to take out three, unless I get faked out, which I might. Right, holding Q. Wait for it. Wait for it. Ah, there you go. That's one. Two. And three. Now that guy should run in terror if he had any fucking sense. He doesn't have any sense. Perfect parry. Encounter over. Bosh. <laughs> oh, sorry. Encounter not quite over. Encounter over. <laughs> that was that skill was worth taking. The opportunity to, to, to trim down a group by three before you actually start fighting them is uh, pretty good. I am down with that. Um, what we might do, we might cross over here, liberate that, and then go to the uh, forge and see about upgrading. I think we can get another katana upgrade, which, considering it's the tool I'm using the most, probably wouldn't be a bad idea. Let's go, Kage. This is so funny. I'm looking down at OBS and every so often it jumps up to like 10,000 uh, KPPS and I'm kind of like, oh no, something's broken. I'm like, nope, nope, this is this is how it is now. And I'm like, cool. I'm okay with this. 
Uh, so yeah, for those of you who uh, just joined, we're testing out the new version of OBS, which has the uh, Twitch enhanced broadcasting. Um, so we're giving that a spin. And so far it's doing pretty good. And as much as nothing fell down yet. Wait for it. Wait for it. That's one. That's two. Oh, he's a big fella, too. And that's three. Is that it? Wow, that's... Yep, that's totally worth it. Totally worth the price of entry, that one. Because those big fellas can be a right old pain, so... Uh, I'm down with that. Pretty strong, yeah. I got my timing right, yeah. Actually, when I was uh, testing this uh, earlier uh, this afternoon... I did get faked out a couple of times, which is probably why it's not happening now, because uh, I remembered how to, like, read it a bit better. Because <laughs> the thing is, if you if you mistime it, you lose virtually all of your health. Because um, it's like a, a do-or-die kind of uh, expression. Am I there yet? No, nope, not quite. Am I there yet? Now, is this an outpost or a village? I think this is an outpost. Um, which mobile app is upgraded to a slight? Yeah, I I think uh, this is like I've actually sort of seen a um. Uh, a video by somebody... That's a bear. Is the bear going in the camp? Oh, this is genius. Uh, to be continued. Sorry, I need to watch this bear. Two bears! It's it's a double bear special! Oh, I mean, you guys can just get on with them. Uh, that's, that's fine. That guy just got absolutely ruined. Okay, he's taken out three guys. Three guys. Uh, not bad. Not not bad. Not bad ratio for a bear. Good work. Um, <laughs> I love when that happens. Anyway, to continue my uh, uh, anecdote, um, uh, a creator who is much bigger, like huge bigger than I am, was complaining that the sort of like the TikTok and YouTube shorts have kind of knackered content creation a little bit because everyone expects everything to be a nice little, like, 30-second snapshot of stuff. And anything longer than that, a lot of people aren't interested. And it's kind of like, the, there is a grain of truth to it. Right, we've got an ad at the moment, so I'm going to chill out for about 80 seconds um, before I start kicking this lot, lot's ass, because uh, there's an ad. Also, I'm rather thirsty, so I'm going to have a drink while I'm at it. I must admit, a bear asaka sounds like someone stripping off all their clothes and then going mental with an axe. But I suppose the spelling on that would be slightly different. That would be like B A R, like a bear asaka. <laughs> oh, I'm in a weird mood today. Yes, that is also true. Um, that there is so many fake accounts, and frankly, on like YouTube Shorts and stuff. If um. I, I I try and put out like one short per per stream if I can manage it. I'm not don't bust my hump to do it. Um, and it's so funny because you will watch views be added, you will watch views be taken away, you will watch likes and dislikes be added and taken away. All of it makes all of it is clearly like shenanigans. So it's like it's no wonder really. But yeah, but that's that's what everyone thinks that if you're using a mobile device that, that TikTok is the thing you want, so yeah. Right, okay, let's commence that. Rant over. See now, hilariously, they're now on alert. I mean, they're on the alert for bears. I doubt they're on the alert for samurai, but um... How can I... Well, there's quite a lot of dudes, actually. Okay, that guy's, that guy's wandering the perimeter. There's two guys out on the perimeter. I guess I could probably go get them first. 
I was saying, if any video gets successful, it hits a threshold and is automatically hit by a fake copyright strike. Wow, that's impressive. Yeah, that's kind of like, whoops. It's kind of like why I don't bust my hump too much with the YouTube side of things. The only reason I put my stuff on YouTube is the fact that it gets deleted from Twitch in two weeks. Uh, so, like, there's still a record of it down the line. But as far as, like, actively, like, trying to get your YouTube stuff to take off, I'm thoroughly not fussed because my focus is Twitch at the moment. And, and doing that and YouTube, I think my head would come off. So, uh... I know somebody, somebody else, uh, a streamer, I, a, a streamer I know, is doing pretty good on both at the moment, and fair play to them. But I'm just like, yeah, I'm good. I'm a filthy casual. I know my limits. <laughs> Don't turn around, Stavity. Nice. And also, the only thing on YouTube about, like, being big on YouTube is, like, the monetization. And the trouble is, you might, the moment you get the monetization, you get the ads, and the ads on YouTube are like, oh my god. Which is hilarious, because this is going to end up on YouTube, and uh, I'll be bitching about YouTube on YouTube later. So, um, there's that. That'll be fun. But it's true. So it's like, uh, not worrying about it too much, to be honest. Uh, can we pull that guy away? I'm using, like, proper ninja tactics here. Where's my chimes? Uh, let's try... How about here? Ding! Why did the bush go ding? Because there's a samurai hiding in it. That's why. Bush go ding! Tanto goes. Oh, I need him in the face! Okay, I mean... Stabbing the guy in the throat was bad enough, but whilst the, during the course of that, I then need him in the face on top of that. I would, I thought that'd be a bit unnecessary, but okay. What are we down to here? One, two, three, four, five, six. There's still quite a lot of dudes. Uh, it's so most of the ideas people have that YouTube could just fix it are terrible. Yeah. Yeah, I can imagine some people have some funny ideas about uh, how that can be uh, adjusted. Okay, I think the guy with the the, the two guys at the, the front are fairly well on their own, aren't they? Yeah, okay, we're going to double back, actually. Oh, okay, that's the wrong button. That's the right button. But yeah, we had that problem with the... I say we, I had that problem with uh, my Ascent videos. Even though um, it was because there were some actual, like, music tracks in certain places. Now, they weren't harmful copyright strikes, but I don't like getting the attention of the copyright strike system, like, ever. Um, but they were perfectly, uh, it was, it was, like, a harmless strike, but it was just, like, every time I uploaded it, it's like, hey, this track is, like, the... but it doesn't make any difference. Also, if it doesn't make any difference, why have the strike on it? It's sort of, like, it strikes me a bit weird. Why is that guy, did that guy not notice me? He didn't notice me. And he's got his back turned. These bears have done me a great favour. <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's the other side of it. Because even though it's it's a quote unquote not harmful strike, um, the video would still be demonetized. But then, like I say, if I ever got to that point on YouTube, it's like, would I really want to monetize my videos on there? Because the the ad thing is so aggressive. Um, who knows? Things I probably won't have to worry about ever. <laughs> no, no, no. You didn't see me. I'm invisible. Right, how many got left? Four? Five. I think I can probably handle five. Maybe. Let's try it. Fuck it. Hello! Come on, I. Oh, shit. Any more for any more? You appear to be not dying, sir. Oh, no, you did. Good. Well done. Easy for you to say. Oh, 
I love that skill. I cast Boot to the Face. Well, that was pretty efficient. Thin their numbers down and then went in like an absolute mad bastard and killed everyone. What have we got here? Mongol plans. Ah, okay. Convince the local population that Mongols are liberators of the poor. <laughs> Hmm. We should use those sticky bombs. How many sticky bombs do I have? Black powder bomb. Oh, it's quick fire, isn't it? I gotta remember there's so many menus in this. Is there only two? Wow, I can only, I've only got two. Okay, they're pretty good, actually. I have to say, the sticky bombs are a bit crazy. So that's probably why I've only got access to two of them. Oh, more iron. Uh, any more for any more? See, I'm actually hearing that wind chime, and I think it's a, I think it's a, a, a Twitch alert. That's actually quite funny. That was the whole point of having like the the, the Chinese sort of uh, Chinese, Jesus Christ, the Japanese themed kind of like uh, uh, stream alerts, but now I'm like twitching every time I hear a chime. It's quite funny. Right, I think we have largely stolen everything that isn't nailed down and probably a few things that are nailed down. Right, I believe we can call this area liberated. Yep. Oh, okay, that clears Fog of War. How, how long have I been playing this? Oh, I didn't notice that this clears the Fog of War. Derp. Okay, well, it looks like a village or something over there. Let's go have a look at that. I don't remember seeing that before. Uh, is that across the river? It's across the river. That's a good point. If I go swimming in the river... Oh, no, wait, the headband is always covered in blood. I forgot about that. That's That's the point of the headband. Wait, am I getting pulled by the current? Now that is a neat little attention to detail moment. The river is flowing in this direction, I have my hands off the control, and I'm actually flowing in the direction the river goes. I like little touches like that. That's actually quite cool. Okay, come on. I like that. It's the little things. Master, okay. Alright, is this an area of import, or is it just a random bunch of buildings I've already gone past at some point? <laughs> yeah, that doesn't- that does not sound like a fun time for anyone involved. Oh, there are people here. Shit. Can I not- can I not do standoff? No? No standoff? They've realised how powerful my standoff power is, and they're not letting me do it now. Uh, oh, no. I take Fire it back. <laughs> right, let's not cock this up. Right. Hold on, Q. Wait for it. Ooh, that was a speedy one. Nice. And that's three. Which leaves us... One poor guy. Oh, he... Okay, he, he saw that coming. But probably didn't see that coming. Anymore? I think we got him. Help! You'll be free soon. This is a miracle. Go, and stay safe. Please, this is for you. If it is a miracle, it's a four-foot-long, incredibly sharp miracle. <laughs> Actually, how long is a katana? That's not four-foot. Is that more like three-foot? Somebody in chat will know. How, how long is the average katana? In feet. 
do people do feet anymore? I don't know. I know a lot of the uh, English swords were around about full feet. Uh, yes, an awful lot of... Uh, there is not a massive amount of variation in the peasant uh, people. No, there, there is that. It depends on the katana and the era. Ah, okay. I actually forget when this is meant to be set. Obviously, during the... Mongol invasion of this place, but I can't actually remember what... Is it 12... 1200 and something? I think it's meant to be 1200 and something, isn't it? I've been paying attention, honest. Okay, there wasn't much to liberate here, because apparently they, they don't have any stuff. Or do they? I love this, it's so morally ambiguous, I'm like, You are free! I am now stealing all your stuff. slightly interested as to what this this serves what purpose this serves actually it looks not sure uh some of them weren't very long they actually changed the zone after the second invasion to make them longer oh okay because yeah i think the one like his one to me in my eyes it's a bit tricky with scale that is relatively short for a katana. Actually, if I drew it, that would make more sense, wouldn't it? You can actually see what was going on. But I think that is re relatively short? I don't know. Uh, hey, what's up? How's it going? Hamster, look what I found last night. Uh, what did you find? The, the, the emote? The, the little, the little gray, gray guy? That's kind of cute. What were you expecting, Sephiroth? No, that would be a... Is it a Dai Katana? Those things are... Those things are insane. Oh, Golden Kappa Train. Oh, okay. Where, what, where does that... Where does that result from? That is actually fairly long for a Katana. Ah, oh, okay. Uh, it's the Tachi of Chalonga. Oh, okay. There you go. Random sword facts with Hamster of Wrath. Well, actually, not really with me at all, because I didn't know where the world. Oh, it's a hype train. Ah, I see. Cool. Yeah, we, we are just, uh, we. I don't want to keep referring to our thing as we. Me? Oh, my horse is stuck. My horse is stuck on the other horse. Or something. Uh, the no Daishi, which is the gigantic thing. Ah, yeah, that's what I was thinking of. Yeah, that's the that's the enormous two-handed thing, isn't it? Yeah. Um, yeah, I've adjusted our hype train, uh, my hype train settings on here. I, I keep referring to us as a collective. I need to stop doing that. That's that way madness lies. Um, is that a bear? Oh no, it's a posse of bandits. Um, because our hype train settings were a little bit fucking crazy. I didn't realize they'd been set to automatic. So I, I've turned them into things that are slightly more sensible. Um, hang on, let me get this out of the way. Killing you will only bring me glory. Thought that was a fake out for a second there. Nope. And number three. Now the last guy should run. Get down! Why are archers in this such idiots? Honestly. And st stop. Um, it was crazy low. It was set to two events inside five minutes. Because a couple of weeks ago, I was kind of like, why the hell have we got a hype train? Um, so I've actually changed it to, to a longer amount. A longer amount of things ha have to happen inside a five minute window. Because it was ridiculous. It was like, somebody would donate some bits, and then if I got a raid and something, it was like, Hype Train! And it's like, that that seems a bit excessive. So yeah, we've dialed that down a little bit. Uh, if I were to be someone famous, I'd rather be a B or C lister than an A lister. Honestly, I don't think I want to be famous at all. 
And I know that's probably a weird thing coming from someone who streams on Twitch. But <laughs> I, I don't think I want to be famous at all. Which you may think is a bit of an odd thing coming from a, a streamer. Oh, that's a bear. How close is the bear? Uh, the bear is fairly close. Where is my uh, longbow and where is the bear? All right, explosive arrows are cheating a little bit. Come on, bear. Come on. Come on. And... Oh, I missed! Shit, I missed! Time to adjust. Fuck. Off the horse. Quick, off the horse. I might be about to be killed by a bear. Handled. Sometimes I'm really good with that bow, and sometimes I'm absolute trash. <laughs> it does tend to vary. You have to bear your consequences on your own, yeah. Uh, bear ponds. Um, yeah, because honestly, it's like, you, you see some of the horror stories where you've had, like, content creators get really big, and then they just go insane <laughs> or do something really shady and it's kind of like i don't want to be that person stand and fight me oh it's actually 70 to 80 percent longer ah oh, okay wait for it that's one that's two and that's three. Anyone left after that? Dude on a horse. Oh, of course it's the big fella, naturally. Handled. My god, those guys used to be so difficult to get rid of. Shady business calls to you. No, no, no. Right here. <laughs> Don't forget me. Hold still. I prayed for this. Find somewhere safe. Be careful. Please, a token of my gratitude. You're welcome. Uh, right, eventually we will get to the village. I just keep getting sidetracked by, you know, everyone being in peril. Well, the thing is, the thing is with that, I, I, I've got like... I've got like a mall. I've got well, no, wait. What's the uh, what's the collective term? You've got a katana and a wakizashi. Is it a dai show? I've got is got is what effectively is a mall dai show that a friend of mine got me from a gift shop in Japan many many moons ago, which may or may not be legal to own these days. I'm not sure. Um, but they don't have proper edges on them anyway, and they've just been sat on my bookshelf gathering dust. So once upon a time. But then these days, I'm just kind of like, what am I going to do with it if I did get another one? <laughs> so, yeah. Accidentally killing so many hostages in Metal Gear. Yeah, this is what I was saying earlier on, that uh, the hostage thing in this is actually quite forgiving. Because I can throw exploding arrows, swing my sword around like a maniac, and it doesn't seem to hurt the hostages. Whereas if I the, the bad guys get hold of them, it's like game over. But uh, we've been doing okay on here. Hard to polish without slicing my fingers off. Yeah, that sounds like a liability. Yeah, my, mine are not remotely sharp. They're also not remotely proper either. So, uh, is there a quick way to get down here? Or oh, there is. Look at that. Oh. The quick way down here involves standing on two corpses. I do apologise, gentlemen, but uh, this is clearly a high traffic area. Um, oh, I was going to say, surely there's another way to get down there. Yeah. 
Hey. Okay. Now I have to find the sword guy. Or well, the swordsmith, as he's actually known. I don't remember this place being as on fire last time I was here. Oh, wait, was that actually my fault? That might be my fault. Very functional sword. Yeah, I bet. Oh, there's my, there's my bird GPS. What is my bird GPS telling me? Bird GPS? What, what, what are you telling me? If you're telling me about that legend sky, I don't care because I'm not playing multiplayer right now. No? Okay. What are, what are you telling me? Resources? Banner? Are you guiding me to the sword guy? Because if you guided me to the sword guy, that works. Because I didn't know where the sword guy was, but that's not where you're guiding me. Where, where are we going, bird? Where, where, well, now you've disappeared. Bird? Okay, honestly, wild bird GPS is so flaky. Is there something under the house? No, that's that's. there's no way to get under the house. Something on the roof? Materials on the roof? What was the bird telling me? I don't know what the bird was telling me. I think it's lying. This is why we moved away from Wild Bird GPS. Yeah. I mean, I wanted to fight the sword guy, and uh, that's. But I don't know what else it was trying to tell me. Because it got here and then it just disappeared. Usually when it does that, there's like. Ah! Wait, hold on. Is that it? Oh, no, no, that's just wood. Okay, I got... Oh, it's back again. What are you trying to tell me, bird? What? What is it you're telling me? Oh, under here? Is that what you're telling me? There's nothing here. I think he just likes seeing me crawl through the dirt. I, I think it's probably just telling me where the swordsman is because I, there's literally nothing else here. I mean, if it was a minor bird, at least it could talk and tell me what's going on, but I don't know. I, th I think it's talking nonsense. Right, forget him. Forget the bird GPS. That's a terrible idea. Do, 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 do. Eat the bird. <laughs> hey, Math, how's it going? So, for those of you new to the channel, uh, as far as video games go, Math's solution is either shoot it or eat it. Um, which, you know, uh, I admire his simplicity in the approach, but, you know. Oh, that's true. It might be upstairs. That's a good point. My forge is ready. Right. Uh, 2,000... Wow, I've got a lot of supplies. 86 iron. Nice. 55 steel. Nice. The only thing we're slightly short on is gold, but I use this a lot, so yes. Polished like a mirror. Katana upgrade is go. Again. Now, I can only assume that's probably set us back on the armor upgrades? I don't know. Okay. Five new vanity gear. That's a good point. How many flowers have I got? Because I've got a shit ton of flowers. I can uh, buy some new gear. Um, I think the merchant's over here somewhere. I, do you know what? I probably should have gone with the Tanto upgrade. Because sometimes you do stab people and they don't die. That, that, that's a good shout. Oh well, a bit late now. I'll get back to it again at some point. Shoot, then eat. Yeah. I did not climb up the ladder, but you are correct. Let me, let me, uh, let's have a look here. Sword kits. I have 59 flowers. Okay. Sea dragon's wing. So oh, that looks really cool. Yeah, I'll have that. May it help you bring victory. Emperor's tears. I mean, nice. Shadow demon's eyes. What are your shadow? All of these look very nice. I think you'll be pleased. Armor dies. Uh, I don't think I can. Don't think I can dye the one I'm wearing. So I'm not too fussed about that one. Oh, the Ronin attire. Okay, interesting. Oh wow, what's that look like? That is that is bold. 
that is not what you'd expect from a sneaky suit. Um, Samurai clan armor has nothing. Traveler's tie has nothing. Okay, I guess that's not too worried about that. Half bow? Noble crane. Hmm, I don't know. Right, hang on. What was that uh, samurai thing I just picked up? Uh, here we are. Sea Dragon's Wing. Yeah, let's have some of that. I can't see, it's dark. Okay, the scabbard's a bit weird. Oh no, I've got like something hanging off the scabbard. Okay, that, that makes sense. Oh, the bird's back. The bird's... Okay, bird. Look, I'm gonna go over here and go up the ladder. Is that what you want me to do? Otherwise, I've got no fucking clue. No, no, Sea Dragon's wing. <laughs> if I was running around wearing a Sea Dragon's wang, that would be... Uh different. Ah, yes, there's something glowing up there. Yeah, I think that might have been it. Uh, if that is linen, I'm going to be very upset. I think it's linen. Why would you put linen up there? That makes no sense. But okay. I mean, that possibly wasn't worth the journey, but, you know. Yeah, very smoky linen. Yeah. Uh, how do we get down from here? There we go. Wait, the bird's still here. What? What are you telling me, bird? Where are you going now? It's just fucked off. I mean... That's being... A, that bird's being a massive troll. Don't like it, throw it out, or eat it, or possibly shoot it. <laughs> Any of these. Um. Okay, what we're we gonna do? We're gonna like we're gonna go to Komodo Town. I'm not gonna fast travel because I wanna go. I wanna explore this bit, and then maybe we can do a quest for uh, Masako because that's there. I keep making sure I don't call her Masaka, but because that, that's something else entirely. Shoot the linen? Sure, not my first choice. I'm not sure eating it would be particularly pleasant. Oh yeah, horse. I'm on a horse. Okay, that away. I was like, why is my horse struggling? I'm like, it's because we're going uphill. <laughs> I think I'd be struggling if we're going uphill. Oh, shit's a bear. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Right, okay, no, not not explosives. Right. Wait, is this the half bow? I think that's the half bow. No, I want the long bow. No. No, what? How do I select the... Oh, it's right click. Okay. And kapow! One shot, one kill. Have some of that. I mean, Bear was minding his own business, but, you know... And for those of you coming back from that break, you've missed nothing other than me shooting a bear. Mostly in self-defense. Oh, oh, extra standoff, extra standoff. Come have a go if you think you're hard enough. Ooh, that was quick. And anyone else? 
guy on the horse. And handled. Oh. And handled. <laughs> Like, sir, would you mind dying? That'd be great. Oh, I love he cleans when when you click on clean the weapon, because I do actually have a button to clean the weapon, which is five. He does it in different ways. It's quite cool. You're going to be alright. <laughs> the best day of my life, my lord. You're safe now. I'd be honored if you had this. <laughs> You're going to be alright, unless you get eaten by a bear, of which there are quite a few around here, apparently. I mean, honestly, if... even if I was some sort of badass Mongol warrior dude, if I saw three of my peers get cut down in less than 30 seconds, and then got off my horse and thought, yeah, I can take this guy. I, I think I deserve everything I get at that point. Because, yeah. Historical samurai were kind of assholes. Uh, yeah, they very much could be, yes. Though I must admit, um, I really quite liked the uh, series uh, Shogun. Uh, because the, what I thought was the great thing about that show is that it showed that everyone was kind of hidebound by the same tradition. Because you have the solitary English guy who's like, this is really stupid, all these traditions getting in the way of doing common sense things. And he kind of has a point. But then it, it's like you show the other characters have to work within the framework of of the traditions they had at the time because that's the way it was done kind of thing. And it's interesting to see how people can... You had to twist it around to make all the politics work. Which I found thoroughly fascinating. Would I like to live in that particular situation? No. Because I would probably be very dead very quickly. Because I would say I'll do something wrong. And uh, someone would probably have me head off. But, you know. It's still quite an interesting thing to, to look at. You want a lot of way to top not the state of Japan unless you're a sumo wrestler? Yeah, I, I could I can I could see that, yeah. Are you repairing that? Or are you chopping it down? I think you're repairing it. Let's assume you're repairing it. Uh. Wait, hang on, was that an actual village? They might have had a side quest in there. Hang on a minute. Hey, the sun's come out. I didn't see a side quest. No. Nope, no side quests. Casual theft, though. Quickly, quick. Great film if an unbelievably slow starter. Don't think I've ever watched that one. I must admit, I did like The Last Samurai. Now, I know The Last Samurai takes some fairly big liberties with the historical accuracy of stuff, but I still think that's an entertaining film if you look at it as a piece of entertainment versus, uh, you know, any remotely historical, historically accurate stuff. I still think it's a good film. But yeah, historically accurate, I, I believe not. <laughs> Oh, that looks very on fire. Is that supposed to be on fire? Probably not. Is that the direction we're heading in? That's not even the direction we're heading in. What am I looking at? Okay, let's take a detour because that looks very on fire. That's because it's Mongol territory. Uh, Ran, which is King Lear in feudal Japan. Oh, okay. Whoa! My horse said, fuck you, buddy. I am catapulting you off the thing, which is fair. Akira Kurosawa. Oh, okay. Right. More hostage situations. This is fine. 
See, this is great. I've been I've been like playing for nearly like like an hour and 40 minutes and I have done zero plot whatsoever and I'm still having a great amount of fun. This is great. There is an Akira Kurosawa mode. Okay, I tell you what. I tell you what. For this Can we do it from here? Or is it? For this outpost thing, I'm going to put it in Kurosawa mode. Now we're in Kurosawa mode. Which is hilarious, because now I can't, because there's no colour, I can't tell who's a good guy and who's a bad guy when I do Batman Vision. Which is kind of funny. <laughs> um, that could be an interesting challenge. It'll be fine. And yeah, that guy's all in his lonesome. I can probably have him. Which way are you facing? Oh, you're you're doing something. Quick, go 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 go! Shit, shit! Uh, he was a bad guy, wasn't he? I'm sure he's a bad guy. Yeah, I know. I was so used to him being outlined in red, and now they're not. Oh yeah, yeah. It changes the sound. Yeah. I feel like it's too quiet, but we're gonna we're gonna do it just for this uh, just for this outpost for giggles. Oh no, I think they saw me. Don't give me away, cow. Or ox, wherever you are. Oh oh, if they turn their backs, we can do the double assassination. Go on, turn around, turn around, turn around, turn around. There's nothing here. Okay, this is another very little... Right, okay. I bet you they're going to turn around before I get there. Okay, I stacked that slightly. Excuse me, coming through. Where's the hostage? There he is. Could I? Oh, it takes away the stagger indicators. In fact, it actually disables the uh, it disables the health bars. That's kind of cool. Right, we good. Nope, the one guy left. There was a chain assassination. I actually did it. And then promptly hit the wrong button when I was looking at that guy. Um, yeah, these two. I actually did it very quickly. Um, I, you, had, you have to jab Q in quick succession. Which is a bit weird, because the regular assassinate is left click. So, yeah. I must admit, this is cool. I think I prefer it with the, the like the proper sound going on. I'm gonna be pretty honest with you. Yeah, it just feels it just feels like I'm kind of like I'm suffering hearing problems because everything's muted. Oh, kill the enemies without being seen. Didn't see that. Never mind I. What's still? I'm saved. Be careful up there. I thought sensei. I like the fact it's an option, but yeah, not for me. It also, I think it ups the difficulty a little bit as well, because some of the prompts um are hidden. Um, which is fine. Oh, kill enemies without being seen. Not kill everything without being seen. Okay, we might be able to do that, maybe. Maybe. Okay, there's a guy to the right who's fairly isolated. We might better go get him. That guy's yelling at a hostage, which is fine. He's yelling at a hostage a lot. Right. Yeah, no, I literally I was about to say, I bet you if I move, that guy sees me. 
And the moment I was about to exit the reeds, that guy turned around. Which was kind of funny. Oh, piss. Oh, it resets. Oh, I fucked that completely. Excuse me, coming through. Pardon me, coming through. No, no, no. Wrong stance. Right stance. Good eye! Ow. Got it that time. Ow, ow. Ow, ow. Come on, try for a perfect one. Yeah, there we go. Patience. Patience. I don't have any. <laughs> okay, we're not going to get that. Because you have to kill someone without being seen, and then it resets if someone sees you. So i got to kill three guys in succession without being seen. I, I, I feel that might be... Uh, irksome at best. Oh, enemies no, nearby? Really? Until they're dead. Where? Oh, hello. I love it in games like this. There's one guy who's utterly failed to notice what's going on every single time. That was I'm dead in uh I I I am gurgling. Yep. Anything good in here? Wait, was that the guy I just stabbed? That was the guy I just stabbed. God, I got like a memory like a goldfish. Actually, I think that was disproven as a bit of a myth, that one, the whole goldfish memory thing. Right, now I think I can help you because I think everyone's dead. Be all right. My life is yours. Find somewhere safe. Be careful. Right, so we need to kill two more dudes without being seen, and then that'll be bonus points. Okay. Uh, again, if I was a hostage, where oh, this place is bigger than I thought, as always. Okay, there's two guys who are facing away, and I've got double assassinate. This might work. Maybe. Oh, come on. It's like they set it up for me. Right, come on. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Oh, shit. Fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. I should have known that would happen. Right, so the anecdote I cut myself off at earlier was the neat little touch when they have two people patrolling and they both walk up to somewhere. If they're on alert, when they start retreating away from the spot they're investigating, one guy will face forwards and walk backwards. The guy behind him will face away and walk forwards. So they actually do like a, a hundred, like a full 360 coverage if they're on alert, which I think is a neat little, neat little thing. They're not doing it now because they're not actually alerted. Um, but I bet you the computer went, hey, that guy's creeping up behind you. We're not gonna make it over that the computer has let on that he's there. Right, come on, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Q, 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 Q. Chain assassinate. You gotta be quick. Oh, we got seen. Okay, so it. Yeah, that. That's not great because even though you assassinate the first guy, the other guy just stands around looking at you until you get to the second dude. You're better off just kind of like, if you're trying to link it, so now I've just lost that bonus now, so never mind. Let's not worry about that too much. I mean, it's not useless, it's just, it, it's, it doesn't pause, so it's, if you've got more than one person, it's not very fast. Yeah, I think we're going to give up with this whole not being seen nonsense, but if I can pick off a couple more people before... Otherwise, we're running around like a headless chicken trying to take out the um, people killing the hostage, which is not really what I want. It's standoff for stealthy peeps? Yeah, probably.
I am hiding. I am the groundhog that lives under your house. It's so funny, you can see that the computer knows where I am, but I haven't actually reached the criteria of actively being alerted yet. It's so funny, I've played enough stealth games to know that much. Right, what if we're quick? If I sh Oh shit. Never mind. That's one. Kunai! Sort of barge! Wrong stance. Okay, if you want to be like that. Hand. Mission success. Little scrap around the edges. Oh, enemies nearby. One guy left. One guy who is blissfully unaware I have just horrendously jobbed all his friends. Nope, can't jump up there. Okay. I was going to go for an aerial, but I wonder if I ran and tried it. Hang on, let's try that. Oh, there you go. Hello? Well, I reset it to one. <laughs> but I think that's everybody now. Never mind, I. Assassinate the bull. Gosaku himself. Please take this key. He'd be grateful if you donned his armor. Okay, so we've got three of these keys now. That's cool. We need to keep her safe. Um, nope, yep, there we go. Oh, more technique points. Nice. I thought for a second my either eye had shrunk or my horse had grown. And I realized what usually happens is they usually do it from here. And they actually did it from here, and it's like, my horse is fucking massive. <laughs> it only just dawned on me, my horse is a fucking Goliath. Right, are there any side quests? Should be a little white indicator if there were. I don't think there are. I'm also glad they don't get me on corpse duty. It's like, uh... Lord, Lord Sakai, you have left many corpses in our village. Would you mind help cleaning them up? No. I have more corpses to make somewhere else my horse is amazing <laughs> hey a weeble reference i appreciate those magical trevor yes that's that's my horse's name now it's magical trevor it's not it's car game but magical trevor is funnier yep that's me stealing all your stuff again right excellent accidental liberation on the way uh, that's cool. We will eventually get to some plot. I nearly, I nearly tried to jump on the bull there. That would have gone very badly. I don't think the bull would be happy about it. Hello, bull. No, nope, he just. Okay, sure. Wasn't happy about that. I mean, I let's face it. If you know somebody just walked up to me and tried to jump on me, I don't think I'd be very happy either. Pretend you're. Actually, somebody did that. Wait, is this my horse? There's my horse. Somebody did that to me uh, at school many, many moons ago. And despite the fact I did not know any sort of like martial arts training in the slightest, I grabbed his arm that was around the front of me and I just snapped forward at the waist 
and I sent him looping over the top of my back. <laughs> he landed on his feet, which is fair play, but I was just like, yeah, don't do that. It's rude. Ah, this looks like a mess. I'm gonna change my headgear. I'm gonna change my headgear. Now they can see it half the time. Uh, here for the ninja wrap, which isn't actually that much different. Uh, let's try one of the hats, actually. I want my proper hat. Hero of Tsushima, Betrayer's hat. Where's the the straw hat that's black? There you go. That that looks hilarious. I now look like some sort of uh, receiver dish, but okay, that's fine. All right, can we get a standoff? Send your best warrior. Keeps the sun off. Yeah, exactly. All right, here we go. Wait for it. Whoa! Speedy. Speedy, speedy. I do like how they vary in the attack times, so you have to pay attention. Which is really quite cool. Oh! That cheeky little jump always gets me. Except that time where I got hit. Because there is like a tiny little delay when you like, he, he takes a little bit to get set in the block. So, so it's the little zippy short fast attacks, which sometimes sort of I completely miss. Oh, that's his horse. Okay. See, it's not theft if I take it. It's a uh, lawful repossession. That's how that works, isn't it? I'm sure it is. I thought for one second I was going to get knocked off my horse by that tree. That would have been funny. I would have been okay with that if that happened, because I would have deserved it. Uh, well, what's this? First, first assessment, is it full of bad guys? Doesn't appear to be. Okay, I've decided I don't like the hat. No, change my mind. Don't like the hat. Oh, Tales of Iki are now available. Journey into the past. Oh, okay. I've got no idea what that's about. Peasant told me of people driven mad by mysterious chanting Mongols, a village near Drowned Man Shore in Akashima. I should investigate. Rewards. New explorable region. Yeah, it looks like DLC. Yeah, I might leave that till later. Ah. Kill? No, need better hat. Oh, I can have the little arrow hat. That's quite funny. Let's let's have the regular hero of Tsushima hat on. There we go. Actually ties the outfit together then. There you go. Oh, there is a side quest here. I thought there might be. Oh, the supplies. Yoink. These are dark times, my lord. It would be wise for you to seek aid from Kami. Their shrines lie beyond the Toriyi gates. Sometimes I wonder if they hear our prayers. They're always listening and watching. If you persist in your efforts, they will answer. Thank you. I'll keep trying. They are always watching. What, even when I pee? Slightly worrying. Um, it does make me chuckle that sometimes these things are clearly like, have you never finished, visited a shrine before? It's like, yes, I've visited about three. <laughs> 
Sorry, but I already know how those work. Just in case you have a memory like a fish, I tell you about shrines. This is very pink. Good lord, this is pink. What? What? Oh, it's a bush. Okay, fair. I was like, why is my horse jumping? Nearly there. This game is fucking huge. Oh, the encoding suffered there something chronic, did it? Oh, not good. Uh, let me have my stats. Where are my stats? Uh, I've only dropped a couple of frames. Oh, you mean it broke up? Oh, it wasn't stuttering, it just broke up. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I thought you meant it was, like, stuttering. But yeah, it, it'll, it'll go fuzzy with the grass. Uh, the, oh, no, no, horse! No, no, Jesus Christ. Oh, is it that bad? Oh dear, that's not good. I mean, honestly, uh, I might try this at 30 FPS, because I don't think it makes that much of a difference uh, visual-wise to you guys, whereas I imagine the actual performance, the actual quality of the image is probably a lot better, so maybe next time I'll try it in 30. Yeah. It's kind of interesting, because it's it's... The most it's giving me with this automatic thing is, like, 10,000. I feel that 12 should be about right, because I think that's what I did with um, Assassin's Creed. Um, but it's not... It keeps dropping down to sort of about 9,000 and something, which I still don't think is enough for 60 FPS. So maybe, uh, maybe I'll try dropping the frame rate next time. This was a pure, like... How far can I push this? Um, kind of thing. So yeah, it is a bit of an experiment. Right, I don't think there's anything here. That might be a side quest, perhaps. Or not. I'm gonna steal this stuff right behind them. Yoink! Uh, hey, Lost Call, I reply in a minute. There's an ad, so you probably won't be able to hear what I'm saying. <laughs> I believe they were actually saying, um, after this release with, uh, OBS, that AV1 is in the pipeline, apparently. Um... I think it was in the release note somewhere for OBS. Um, so it's 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 on the horizon, I believe. Oh, there's another side quest. You seem lost in thought. Is everything all right? There's so much to fear right now, my lord. But there are still places of beauty to remind us what truly matters. Even the birds know it. I followed the flock to a place that filled me with peace. I used to write haiku in places like that. There was no better place to center my mind and body before battle. I hope you'll find peace again soon, Lord Sakai. Not anytime soon. 
Uh, yes, Lost Call. Uh, the reason I am wearing the noob armor is that I found it a bit easy wearing the samurai clan armor. So I've nerfed myself a little bit by wearing the noob armor, which means I take slightly more damage because, frankly, I felt way too tanky uh, wearing the clan armor. So I don't mind taking a bit more damage because um, it felt a bit OTT. So that, that is why I'm wearing the noob armor. <laughs> Uh, hey, Moon Eyes, how's it going? Dodge this, you effing casual. <laughs> In regarding the 41st millennium, excellent. Yes, Kadia broke before the guard did. Or something. I think that's how it goes, isn't it? But welcome, hope you're doing well, and I hope you're doing well as well, Lost Core. Yeah, sorry, literally, you turned up and asked the question. I was like, oh, there's an ad. Great. Uh, but thank you for the reminder, Bamboozle. Yeah, I'm trying to sort of time it so nothing interesting happens during the ad breaks, because I am aware of when they happen, so I'm, I'm, I'm trying to sort of work around them. Uh, keep going, we're good. Because even wearing the noob armor, I've got a couple of charms that reduce incoming damage, and I think it's... Purely because um, the damage reduction from the clan armor and the charms on top, I feel it just made it a bit too tanky. Wait, hang on. It says this is Mongol territory. Oh, that's on my right. Ah. Oh, yeah. This entire village. I've somehow... How did I not notice there was a village there? That's impressive. That was kind of funny. I was like, what village? Uh, that one. Oh, yeah. Um. Okay, defeat the Mongols. Kill an enemy with kunai. Now, that's... Not actually that difficult. I have to viciously wound them first, and then fling one at them. Right, these people are not hostages, I don't think. Oh, that guy might be. I get in there? Mmm. Oh, oh, look at that. <laughs> Can I assassinate him from there? No. Can I drop down soundlessly, soundlessly behind him? Also, probably not, but I'm gonna try it. Surprise! You're welcome. Be the one with a pin, not the one with a grenade. It's it's a fair point. Right, okay. Uh, can I get back out that way? That'd be pretty stylish. Oh, we'll be using the ladder this time round, but that's okay. Uh, loop. Oh, I missed some loot. Hang on, coming back. And, oh, shit, no, keep missing the loot. Don't mind. Don't mind me. It said so right there. <laughs> yes. Okay, two dudes passing by on horses. That's fine. I mean, actually, we don't need to... Oh, this guy's... Okay, right. We need to take care of the uh, archers because that would be bad news bears otherwise. Oh, you fucking moved. But you died, so that's a plus. That was a critical, and nobody noticed. Perfect. Well, that's their air cover handled. Come and have a... Oh, it's a big fella. All right, we need big fella stance. Right, now he is prime kunai. Whoop. Got him with the kunai, that's good. Damn it, I'm doing too much damage, that's quite funny. Handled! Hey, Wabba! How's it going? Welcome, welcome. Thank you very much for the raid. Let's give you a shout out there. Lost Epoch. Ooh. I have no idea what that is. Uh, thank you very much for the raid. Welcome in, everybody. Hope you're doing well. Thank you very much for that. I hope Lost Epoch was fun. I've got no idea what it is. Bonk. Oh, wrong stance. Wrong stance. Oh, shit. Still wrong stance. Come on, then. 
Oh, you're up. Okay. Boot to the face. That's enough out of you. Uh, sort of like Diablo. Ah, okay, cool. It's a blast. Yeah, I had a go at, um... Oh, God. What's the other one called? Uh... Path of Exile? I think I had to go at Path of Exile. Um, I haven't tried the last epoch, though. It's a blast. Excellent. Glad you're having fun with it. Yeah, we're trying out the new, uh, the new Twitch encoding, um, shenanigans today. Which is largely why I, this was a bit of an impromptu stream. Um, because they've got the enhanced broadcasting thing going on in OBS now. So, uh, yeah, we're giving that a, giving that a go. Oh, perfect parry. Good night, Vienna. Anyone else? Okay. Oh, imperfect parry. Perfect parry. Nice. Yeah, I haven't played it for years, but I remember finding it like, um, yeah, it was pretty good. Also, it cost a hell of a lot less than Diablo 3, so... <laughs> that was my other reasoning, I think. Oh, somebody fucking blew a horn. God damn it. Well, that's everyone else alerted. That's fine. Right, let's uh, push this way, because there's less people over here. Do -do 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 Boing. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, I can't hear you over being dead. Oh dear, these guys don't look very well. They're either drunk or... Not sure. Are you dying, dying, sir? Or is this... He's just not very well. Okay. Oh, there's two archers here as well. That's, uh... That's an oopsie. Did he blow the horn and no one came? That's... Taken out of context, that statement could be quite funny. Um, no, apparently doing that did, did nothing. All right, it works for me. Let's, yep, let's get the half bow going. I mean, no, let's not do that. And poop. And poop. He's like, no, why did this guy fall down? It's such a mystery. What happened? Now he knows. <laughs> oh, that was thoroughly amusing. Can I knock people off their horses? I feel I should be able to knock people off their horses. Phrasing. Is phrasing still a thing? Yeah. Woohoo! Oh, they didn't even see me. Oh! Okay, now here's a revelation after however many fucking hours I've been playing this. If you're in stealth and you throw the kunai, they don't necessarily know where you came from, because that was two stealth assassinations. That's pretty cool. He has no friends. Not now, he doesn't. I am the hamster in the nuts. <laughs> yeah. I am the one who squeaks. Yes. See? All in a row. Any of you got arrows? That'd be great. No? No arrows? Really? You're an archer and you haven't got arrows? Okay. The... Oh, okay. The heavy arrows are rarer. I have to remind... Can I, can I tightrope walk? Oh my god, I can. I also didn't know I could do that. Wait, was that a grapple symbol? I can grapple off these? We are learning things today. Holy shit. I didn't know I could do that. That's kind of funny. Right. Um, have we won? I don't think we've won. No, not yet. Different gauge arrow. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah, I'm after the I'm after the twelve gauge arrow, and he's only got the eight gauge arrow. Yeah. No, actually, wait a minute. That's not how that works. Because uh, the lower the gauge, the bigger the um. The lower the gauge, the bigger the pellet. So actually, I was looking for the sixteen gauge arrow, and nope. Let's try that again. I was looking for the eight. Abandon the pun. 
Abandoning the pun. It's a Sunday. My my pun well has runneth dry. I'm abandoning the pun. You got the gist or you didn't. <laughs> All right, train tracks? That would make more sense. That would have probably made a bit more, more sense. I was thinking shotgun pellets for some reason, but you know, good. That's me. There you go. The lower the gauge, the bigger the barrel caliber. That's it. Yeah, but I got it right. Just, just I, I abandoned the pun. The pun required abandoning. Barry needs Warsaw Pax Arrow. <laughs> yeah, this is the wrong bullet. Uh, Barry, that's a, that's a bow and arrow. That's not how that works. You silly man. Pellets are more or less the same size. Oh, okay. This guy's not going away, is he? Okay, fine. You can watch me assassinate your friend in right in front of you. And I parried that without looking. Nina. Anyone else? No? Oh, 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 hang on. You saw nothing! Nope. You saw nothing. I'm outside. You saw nothing. Surprise! Oh, I did a cheeky little drop kick. That was quite funny. And liberation. Yay. Pun required a pundening. It really did. I figured by the third attempt I should just give up because I thought, yeah. Wait, I said standoff, but oh, here we go. Stand and fight me. We're abandoning stealth. Ah! Wait for it. That's one. That's two. And I couldn't see the other guy, so I had to guess. But apparently, I got it right. Get styled on, noobs! Oh, hello. Oh, perfect parry. Nice. I was trying to do the kick and it didn't work. I was trying to do the boot to the face, but never mind. Oh, there's one guy left. I'm not even using the combos that you're supposed to use to take out each particular guy, but I'm okay with that. Oh, he's not dead. I just cleaned my sword! How very dare you not be dead the first time round. It needs to be as confusing as possible. Yeah, I thought... Because it's ridiculous. You get up to certain gauges, like... Isn't, isn't there, like... Isn't the punt gun like a something ridiculous gauge shotgun? Something like that? I can't remember. Or was that actually solid shot? That might be solid shot. I'm an armchair. I'm an armchair arms kind of guy. I only know mostly what video games have told me. Most of which is incorrect. Wait, did we actually liberate that place? Oh, we did. Okay. That's <laughs> it. Leaving a job half done. Also, why am I not using my horse? Oh, piggies! You see, the piggies have got smart because they know that... Yeah, I've got bow and arrow these days. Come on, get, get lost. Oh, missed. In the early game, the pigs used to be a right fucking pain. Um, but these days you shoot one of them and they run away, which is handy, really. Where are you taking me, bird GPS? 
humorous gun with shot in it. Yeah, exactly, yeah. Uh, Drakenfell? <laughs> and Tex for handheld. Yeah, that, yeah, that Tex, Tex knows what he's talking about, unlike me. Right, I apologize for the fuzziness. This is nothing but grass currently. Uh, oh dear. This appears to have gone very badly. Are we there yet? We're nearly there. Oh wait, is that a bamboo challenge? I think that's a bamboo challenge. I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to break out the controller if that's a bamboo challenge. Oh, that's a fight going on down there. Oh. Has she been fighting this entire time? That's quite funny. Could I? Fuck it out. Ow. 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 Oh, for fuck's sake. That's enough out of you. Bonk. Get up, I dare ya. Oh, he's staggered. Never mind. This quest has been active a long time. Has she honestly been up here fighting these guys the entire time? Because that's kind of funny. Load, load up No Man's Sky's hyperdrive. Yeah, I, I gathered that was a bit of a nightmare for streaming. What are you doing here, Masako? Looking for my family. I already found my husband. But I've yet to find my sons. They died as warriors, defending our home. Did you see where they fell? No. The battle was chaos. I could barely keep eyes on my uncle. Let me help you find them. So her husband was the guy that got set on fire by the Khan, or the whatever his name was, I've forgotten. Um, when he was like, "Fight me honorably," and he's like, "Haha, you're on fire." You still need to that was her husband. And in fact, this is where we started the game. Look, over there. Well, yeah, but I mean, that's the same thing with, like, uh, lightsabers, isn't it? In the fact that lightsabers would set you on fire. Yes. But alone, do you think he deserted? When your husband fell, your clan surged forward to avenge their lord. No one fled. It's a comfort to know they were loyal to the end. Keep your eyes open for more of our banners. So yeah, literally in the opening FMV, uh, her husband said, Bring me your strongest warrior, I will fight him. And, and the leader threw, like, alcohol on him, and then threw a torch at him and set him on fire. <laughs> it was kind of like, oh, we're not playing by your rules anymore. So yeah, understandably, she's a bit pissed. Jin, over here. He was riding down the beach. Then we will continue in that direction. I feel she's doing most of the detective work. The Kikuchi banner. I don't recognize him. My sister's husband fought for Kikuchi. Your brother-in-law could be close by. Should we look for him? Right now. I just need to find my sons. Yeah, so bearing in mind, I think the Mongols started recruiting some of the other clans. Um... Uh, for, for, for shenanigans. I'm gonna change my headgear. I'm just obsessed with changing my headgear today. Uh... Do we have, like, a black headband? Or a dark headband? And then I'll put, like... There you go. Let's put the headband of fear. And then we're gonna put the... Beast wrap, and then we've gone proper like that. One of our banners. My horse. 
I almost died with him. What happened? My uncle saved me. We will return the favor. The important thing is, you endured. Yes, this is where I narrowly got blown up in the opening sequence, which was uh, quite funny. This armor increases your strength by 10 and health by 50, but it's ugly! Yeah, we have dang we have downgraded our armor. Like I said, I was finding it a little uh, a little easy. Uh, that's a good point. Did she say? Did they say about saving the uncle? They did, didn't they? Yeah, we have already saved the uncle. I've done things slightly out of sequence, haven't I? Never mind. That's happen. That happens in open world games. Who is he? This is Masanori. He was too young for battle, but his father was old. So he went in his place. Not only a brave soldier, but a good son. Yes. But where are mine? Now this, is, warrior. this is why I was kind of tempted to do as many of the side quests as we could before we freed the uncle, because I was a bit worried about that. The Nago archers fell many Mongols. Their skill was unrivaled. If only Sensei Ishikawa had been with them. Yeah, Sensei Ishikawa was too busy getting shot at by his pupil, probably. Your uncle's banner. During the battle, when I saw these colors on a fallen man, I feared it was my uncle. Only fools have no fear of death. They lead up through the rocks. Our banners. Yeah, it was it was a bit like that, yeah. Uchikage. A close friend of my sons. He would have stayed by their side. They must be near. This way. They left their dead to rot. Like discarded trash. No. Oh dear. Oh dear. Shigesato! Yosanari! Strung up like an Let's get them down. They should be with our family. Buried beside their wives. And children. The journey to Ariake isn't safe. Is there some place close we could bury them that would honor their sacrifice? The lighthouse. They played there when they were young. But it's been overrun by Mongols. Then we take it back. The lighthouse is this way. Turns out I have a specialty in ass whooping Mongols, so we should be fine. Oh, horse. 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 Oh, oh, there he is. They yeah. Climbing that tower. If they didn't come home at night, I could always find them there. Gazing at the stars. You are a good mother. I used to think so. But my children are dead. And I am alive. There is no greater failure. I felt that way when my mother died. That I'd failed her. But you were so young. And she was ill. There is nothing you could have done. Even if that's true. It's a cold comfort. I know. Yeah, uh, the, my horse does sometimes have a roach from Witcher 3 moment every so often. But yeah, I think he was on a bit of a lunch break. They've already seen us. Oh, no time for a standoff. Okay, fine. 
Oh, no! Ow. 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 Right, I'm sorting you lot out. Okay, never mind. Handled. Stay ready. There could be more. They're coming up the hill. Watch the grass. Wait, where? Oh, here? <laughs> That's good. There's a lot of grass. That's the wrong stance. That's the right stance. Ow. Look, through the tree line. They're relentless. Ow. Ow. Oh, he's dead. That's handy. Ow. Where was this guy going? That's fine. Oh. Ow. Oh, my God. How many of these guys are there? Jesus Christ. Right, go on then. Ow. Ow. I don't know if that's the right stance. I don't think it is. No, it isn't. Ouch. Oh, that's unblockable. Need to learn that one. Fucking hell. Okay, these guys I haven't fought very often. Let's try this again. Perfect parry. Good night, Vietnam. There we go. No. Oh, God, I think I just stabbed her. That's rather that's unfortunate. It. She got over it. That was a lot of dudes. Yeah, I, can't, I have to keep reminding myself to flick flack between all the different stances because some of them are literally ineffective against certain types. So if you try and go for, like, the anti-spear stance versus a shield guy, it just won't work. Whereas the sword and anti-sword, anti-shield stances, you can kind of get away with mixing the two up, but... Uh, Oh boy. And there's an ad. Right, let's let that run. I'm gonna go scavenging for stuff. I remember there being a lot more bodies. Did I did I loot all of those? It looks like I might have done. There we good. There we good. Uh oh no, more down there. Oh wow, there was a lot of guys. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I was trying to re-up uh, re my throwing knives there, which I appear to have done. Result! That's exactly what I was trying to do. Oh, one more. Oh, and another one. <laughs> Jesus Christ! That was a lot of guys! That was a lot of guys. Holy shit. Right, have we got, have we got them all? I think we got them all. I mean, honestly, as a, as a sort of, like, one-to-one uh, -one ratio, I think we're punching above our weight by quite a margin. <laughs> ah, okay. Oh. Let's see what she has to say in a little second or so. Like about now-ish. Then it's time. Let's bring my sons. I never let them spend the night here, even when they grew older. 
I always called them home. That's what I missed most after my mother passed. A voice calling for me. Take comfort in knowing she is at peace. They all are. And if they're not I'll see you in Toyotama. There are still conspirators I must find before I can rest. But for now, I'd like to spend some time with my sons. I understand. Be well, Osako. I mean, if they're not resting in peace, they're resting in pieces. One of the two. Uh, humorously, we're not actually wearing the clan Adachi armor. Um, we're actually wearing the hero of Tsushima armor. But yes, it probably would have been more fitting had we been wearing the uh, the clan armor. Charm of Fortunate Return. What does that do? Abilities that use Resolve have a 15% chance to refund one Resolve. Interesting, but I don't... I seem to be able to generate enough Resolve as I go, so... New gift is available at the gift altar? Okay. What I think we'll do... Oh god, map's gone all screwy. That's not good. Oh, was it? I thought that was, uh, I thought the Clan Adachi armor was, was different to that. Was it really? I thought it was different. I thought... Yeah, the, that's the Hero of Tsushima armor. I thought the Samurai Clan armor, that is... There you are. Sturdy armor that once belonged to a son of Lady Masako. Yeah, that's, that's the... That's the armor that's, that's, that was worn by the guy who got set in fire. This, this one's different. Silk? Yeah, uh, silk's for armor upgrades, I think. Oh, there's a bamboo thing there. Hey, Wild Saber, how's it going? Who remembers the sitcom Dinosaurs? Yes, I remember that. I remember that. Oh, shit. Not the mama. Yeah, I remember that one. Yeah, that was, uh, that was kind of crazy. I went entirely the wrong direction. That is most impressive. Impressive. Most impressive. Okay, what I think I'm going to do, I'm going to sort out this pillar, and then I'm probably going to call it quits, because I can actually feel my voice going. <laughs> and since I'm going to be streaming tomorrow as well, I probably need to save my uh, voice box a smidge. So let's go sort this out. Which does involve firing up the controller, as we all know. It's here somewhere. Why am I not using the horse? That's a good question. Wait, is it? Where is it? Oh, it's over there. Can't give up yet, boy. Uh. Not sure what this is, but okay. Am I still going? Oh, it's right over there. There it is! Found it. <laughs> oh no, this is this is not the bamboo thing. This is cosmetics. Okay, that's not so bad. That's not so bad. I thought for a horrible second that was the bamboo thing. Genbu's darkness. For those who celebrate the shadows. Ooh. That's quite cool looking. I love that, actually. There are many blue things. It tends to tie in with the armor. It's quite nifty. Um, okay, right. Um, I'm going to put a manual save in there. Uh, let's just make sure. I think that worked, didn't it? Uh, yep, cool. Uh, and I am going to bring things to a halt there. This was largely a bit of an impromptu stream. Uh, gone on longer than I intended to anyway, but honestly, my voice is actually begin to give out a little bit which does not bode well for tomorrow so i think i'll stop there so let's uh quit out of there yeah thanks everyone for being part of the stream uh yeah this was kind of a bit of an experimental thing to test the new um the new encoding um i'm gonna watch the vod back uh see how it looks might might 
tinker might drop it back to 30 fps for this maybe uh thank you very much wabalablam for the raid it is much appreciated um we had a follow as well come on credits catch up with me um do, do, do. there we go the shogun ryuji thank you very much for the follow um as always you can find my assorted links are there you can find the charity i'm doing a fundraiser for there as well um I'll be back tomorrow, probably with Phoenix Point, because this was a good excuse to do a bit more Ghost of Tsushima. Um, so tomorrow might be Phoenix Point, because everyone seemed to be down for that. So I think that's probably what I'm going to do tomorrow. Haven't sorted my schedules yet, as you can tell by the um, uh, thing hasn't been updated, but I should do that later on. I say later on, it's 7 o'clock. There isn't actually an awful lot of later on to actually do it in, but I will do it later. Right, uh, let's go find somebody to raid. Let's go see what's going on on Twitch. Do, 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 do. What do we got? Um, Mighty Wrath. Oh, gaming. Dormitory. Ooh, who should we raid? Who should we raid? Um, let's go raid our gaming. I haven't done that for a while. He is playing some uh, Phantom Brigade, which I think is mech adjacent, so that could be fun. Gonna put his um, channel in there as well. Please be kind when you raid. Um, I shall see you tomorrow, providing I have a voice, which I kind of hope I do. Um, thank you very much for watching, and I shall catch you later. Bye bye.